it's CEO here, and today I will show you the fastest way to make millions of bells in a matter of seconds, become a billionaire in the game, max out your bell bank account, and become even richer than Tom Nook. In my previous Max Bells video, I showed you how you can get infinite bells in Animal Crossing New Horizons, simply by visiting my island and selling turnips. Now you're probably wondering how this will all work. So let me break down everything you need to know. Be sure to watch the entire video because there are small but important details I will go over that you must know in order to make millions of bells in a matter of seconds. And no, this is not a scam or a clickbait. You can actually get this many bells for yourself. If you're excited about becoming a billionaire, like this video and subscribe to support the channel. Subscribing helps me continue making videos and making the Animal Crossing community richer than ever. First, if you want to get max bells, you will need to visit my island. This will be a modded island, which is perfect safe for you to come visit. A modded island allows me to set the turnip buy price to 999,999,999 bells, which is the highest amount you can sell your turnips for. The next step is to fly to my island. My island can accommodate seven visitors at once, and I know more than seven of you want max bells, so I will hold multiple rounds of island visits so as many of you as possible can visit the island. More information on when and where you can visit my island will be at the end of the video. Once everyone is on the island, sit on a cube light. This is how I will take attendance and make sure everyone is here and ready to sell turnips. Most rounds I will have 7 visitors, thus every cube light will be filled. Next, I will drop 7 stacks of 30 turnips, one for each visitor. Each person then takes exactly one stack of turnips. This means when you visit the island, you must have one free empty spot in your pockets in order to pick up the turnips. Once you have your stack, make your way inside Nook's Cranny. Because of how multiplayer works, you may have to line up and wait your turn to go through the doors. And once you're inside, sell your stack of 30 turnips to Timmy or Tommy. It doesn't matter. Now the next piece of information is crucial. When you sell your turnips to Timmy and Tommy, you must ensure you see this exact negative number on your screen. If you do not see this number when you sell your turnips, you will not get max bells. If this happens to you, please let me know via the in-game chat. But for most of the time, you'll perform the sale perfectly and see this negative number. The bells you make from this sale will not appear in your pockets. They will be directly deposited into your bank account on your own island. Once you complete this step, go back outside and sit on a cube light while we wait for everyone to finish selling. And once everyone is sitting on a cube light, I will end the session. Do not leave the island before everyone is finished or you will be banned from all my switches and all my islands. Once you're back on your island, check your ABD and you will see you have 999 million 999,000 and 999 bells in your account ready to use. However, there are some important caveats to know if you do this max bell trick. None of these are super serious, but I want you to be aware of them. First, you're cornering the stock market, Nook Mile achievement will disappear. You can get this to reappear by selling 65 million bells worth of turnips back to Timmy and Tommy. This basically undoes the negative number you saw when you sold your turnips. If you don't care about this, you can leave it blank and you won't get in trouble or have Nintendo come after you. On my regular island, I have this achievement gone and nothing has happened to me or my island. And second, you will no longer be able to sell anything in your Nook's Cranny Dropbox if your bank account is at max capacity. Once you start to use your bells, your account will no longer be maxed out and you can sell through your Dropbox again. If you've gotten max bells once before and have started to spend them, you can always do this trick again to top off your balance and max it out. And now, the important information on how to visit my island to get max bells. In order to visit my island, you will need a Dodo code. To be eligible to get the Dodo code, subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow my Twitch channel, link in description. I'll be giving out this Dodo code during my live stream on Twitch this Friday, January 21st, starting at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. You will also need a Nintendo Online membership because using a Dodo code involves online play. To use the Dodo code, go to your airport and select I wanna fly, then I want to visit someone, online play, and then search via Dodo code. This is where you will enter the five digit code I provide to you on my Twitch live stream. I will be holding multiple rounds for four to five hours, so as many people as possible can fly to my island. Each round will use a Dodo code, so it will change frequently. A trick you can use to get better odds to fly to my island, because I do anticipate it will be quite busy, is to undock your Switch and use the touch screen to enter the Dodo code. This is much faster than using the joystick on your controller to enter the code. Also, something very important to know is that if after you've entered the Dodo code and Orville says there's interference, this is good. This means you're in the queue to join my island 
as only one person can fly at a time. So if you get this interference message, keep selecting check again. Doing this over and over will eventually let you fly to my island. If you exit this menu, you lose your place in the queue. If you can't make it to the live stream this Friday, all my YouTube channel members will have early access and additional opportunities outside of the Friday event to visit the island and get max bells. The link to become an official CEOMG member of the channel is linked above and below. And that's everything you need to know if you want to get max bells and become an Animal Crossing billionaire. This is your chance to become richer than Tom Nook and never worry about paying off your loans or running out of bells ever again. I hope to see you at the live stream this Friday and turn you into a billionaire. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.